Hello everyone, welcome back to the Elves of Lothlorien campaign. Last episode was an absolutely fantastic episode. We managed to defeat that huge Isengard army and then retake Cass, Kettlehorn, Limir and Edricarn within two turns, which is bloody brilliant. But things aren't going all in our favour as we do see another uh, army under the command of Gothug led north and it is a pretty decent force. It's not amazing by all accounts but it's still a bit of a problem. Uh, we also have Captain Kazurg moving forward with some lovely orcs which he loved to, we hate to see. Uh, we did lose Akhtiaun to uh, Mordor and we are under siege at Dor Nurhak uh, by Long Lagaren of the Neck who's a Nazgul unit with the Dolgador bodyguard. Uh, so we are up against it slightly. Uh, what I might do this episode is try and just counter-attack here, beat these armies back, and then maybe sell some um, settlements over to Dorwinian. and we want to help them as much as possible. possible. Maybe capturing uh, Dorthlau, Dantelad, maybe Logarth. I, I did, we had a comment in the last episode saying to give Logarth to uh, Dorwinian, although it is a fantastic settlement for money-making. Maybe we could trade it for... Rohrberg, trade those three for Rohrberg, that'll be a pretty good trade, I think. Uh, we are close in end turn, I just want to have a little quick look around, see what is left there to do. My words got really confusing, so I don't actually know what I said myself. Uh, yeah, so quick look around, see what we've got left to do. Any missions? Yes, Tith Anduin, uh, we're still doing that one from the last few episodes. Uh, we maybe can do that. So we've got one unit in there. Just reconcentrate all our forces in, trying to capture the Wald, um, Westwald, and Fangorn. Pushing south is a big priority, but we also have the problems in the north. Our Anduin friends are doing pretty crap for themselves, which is not great. In terms of the script, with uniting uh, us into one banner, we have to clear out Torfilin from all orcs, as what I have found, thanks to you, all my lovely viewers and in various discords that this Mercwood has to be completely cleared of all Orc um, forces and this is still under Orc control so clear to fill in and we'll get the united little kingdom I should say of the Wood Elves. Uh, we do need to try and do that but we haven't really got the numbers to mount a siege of that magnitude in the north. We definitely, right plan is take Fenholm and go for the high pass, give the high pass to the dwarves. They would love that. They'd love that for us. Uh, hopefully then they can push north themselves. Okay. They captured both peaks, which is fantastic to see. Okay, enough rambling then. Let's move on to the next turn and see what happens. Okay, and we are going to get the battle of this castle. Oh, we're going to try and pronounce it again. It's really bad last time. Um... Right, they have Sarn's Will, which is a ridiculously good unit. They also have two units of the back Halberds, which is also a very good unit. And the Nazgul as well. So we are probably going to lose this one, which is a bit annoying, but it was bound to happen. Uh, so let's save it. And let's see what we can do. Hopefully we can get at least half the army cleared. I don't know. Let's just see what happens. Fight to the end. Okay. Uh, they have some lovely units coming on the walls. Let's try to see if we can beat them with these guys. Okay, let's go. I think it's fast forward because it's just, it's going to be an absolute slaughter here. If it was one, maybe it was a bit bigger, we could have taken out. Alright, get these back over here slightly, maybe. Alright, we got a whole 4%. That's amazing. Black Oroots are going to rinse to us. 819 compared to 1314. Uh, although that means that they're going to be so much better than my units. I don't know how that works, but apparently this is how it is. In for these guys, why not? Just go for a little shot across the map. They give you some damage. 
get these archers over here. The enemy's ram has breached the gates. To just sand like so. You guys gotta go into guard mode. Nah, I've got this an absolute slaughter yet. The enemy have the walls. Sure do. All will be lost. Sauron's will be gonna get rid of. If we are gonna win this, which we aren't, but uh that's the unit I would aim for. Sauron's will, although they are very a good shock infantry unit, their armor is not that great, I think. Oh, they have no shield, but they have good armor. Okay, got it. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Well, we start this episode with another with another defeat. A bit annoying. Managed to get utterly destroyed in the walls. Fantastic. Nah, do you know what? I'm gonna just give this one up. To be honest, there's no point. <laughs> there's no point trying to fight this one. Yeah, they, 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 just, they just have too many strong units. We have we got trash against well, elvish trash compared to their elite. So we had no chance. I can't be able to fight the one anymore. It was just gonna be a long-winded kick in the teeth. Anyway, there we are. Battle lost. Let's jump back to Camp Europe and hopefully try and retake that because it was a very good settlement. Ah, oh, he has fallen. Okay, uh, battle lost. Oh, that's good. Hopefully, we can build up a little bit at limb here before we have to do anything. That'd be really, really good if I could do that. Doesn't seem like we have the. Uh... Doesn't seem we have the units for at the moment though. <laughs> We're getting a uh, pretty beaten, beaten pretty badly here. Let's try and send this little army here to retake. Ah, the Yawn, I think. Yeah, we probably want to retake that, because that was a really good settlement for us. It made us quite a bit of money. I'm just making three grand a turn, which is really good. These guys are moving there. These guys are moving there. So next turn, I can move out the two other Elven generals. I'm going to keep this guy down by here for now. Without question. Okay, what have we got? Evan Runin has built that. Um, we are going to go for more of that. Lim here. Yeah, that's fine. Andre Khan's built that, and they're going for nothing right now. Probably gonna go for some military or some growth, to be honest. Yeah, more, more health, more health stuff, more money. I'm trying to get money as much as quick as possible, but it's not, it's not really flowing as it used to. If I built that, how much money can we get from trade? Six to eight. That would go up to nine hundred twelve. It's another. 290 gold pays itself off in 20 turns which is okay I guess but nothing else that gives us crap money as well doesn't it yeah we'll try and get it in as soon as possible but no rush for it to be honest the problem with Mirkwood is it just doesn't give you a lot of good settlements for food well food for uh, for money Okay, uh, let's do the Siege of Act of Yawn, because we want to get to take that now, really. And then, probably move on again. We are kind of held out, we have to hold out for a second while my forces get a bit rebuilt. Right, let's jump into the battle here. Oh, they have trolls, don't they? That's not good, is it? Maybe, maybe we'll, uh, maybe we'll wait a turn. Doesn't matter. Oh, interesting. So, why? <laughs> what a strange! They were raw with all the evil factions and the woodland realm. Screw the woodland realm. <laughs> it's like, okay, why would you? Why? Why them of all people? Okay, that's that's fair. Are we at war with them? Yeah, we are. Okay. I have no allies there. Not in a good situation right now. I'm saying that they have—they are really smashing it. To be fair, and they're doing really well for themselves. Right. Uh, let's push the spy back to this settlement here. Get a little spy net going. And let's probably move on then. 
try and get these guys to move out because we want them to be heading west as soon as possible. Uh, any more units I can get here? No. Nope. nope. And nope, nothing yet, which is a bit annoying. Get some of the Lawrence Southerners there. Yeah, try and get some little cheaper units in so that we can actually expand because we need to do that. Right, uh, let's move on yet again then. Okay, nothing happened in the last turn. Uh, as we can see, Mordor are smashing. Oh my god. King of Adonai, Ar Adonai is dead, which is a shame. There we are. That's good, that's good. Uh, that's fine. You are broke, my friend. Yes, I know. Right, that's fine. He goes into there. And these two run into here. Really? Right. He can... Rumor can go this way. He can beat that. By taking no casualties as well, which is fantastic. He keeps pushing on. Uh, what about their... Eren Zunin does not like that either, which is very annoying. But lower tax rate means more happiness, which is fantastic. Uh, let's get them both going towards this settlement here. Take it for the elves. Elves, we must give up the road. All right, let's get to Calvary Probably be better if we get the Calvary for now. That's a strong army. Not looking forward to that. Can I retrain anyone right now? No, which is really annoying. I'm gonna stick you. Oh dear. All our work here seems to do be for nothing if we can't hold what we have. Strength and honor. Noble it would be if you could do something. Let's see if he can win that. Oh, he can. Fantastic. Okay, that's a, that's a decent turn, I guess. Um, Try and get some more money coming in. More something, at least. I'm getting more nothing right now. <laughs> we have nothing. Oh, dear. Um, oh, what's this? Grogol. Anything I can destroy. Brawler pit, yeah, that can go. Fire of gold. Jesus, it's so loud. Right, then these are all. Ah, yeah, yeah that, another thousand gold. For, hey! Right in, uh, in here. Any. I should have read in this earlier, but it's probably good to. It's like a little savings account. Like, ooh, look, we can. We <laughs> can take it out now! Yes! More money! Little scraps to spend on. Oh, Brawler Pit, yes! We have another one. And another one. Oh, this is great. Yeah. Hey, there's another one. Come on. Hunting Lodge, Lumber Camp. Ooh, Lumber Camp's quite good, actually, for us to get the free units in. Probably better for a northern. Um, Faction, though, if I'm honest. I'm ruining. Ah, yes! You have one more. Okay, fantastic. Uh, so that's given us some more things to build with. This is really good. And with that done, we'll probably move on yet again. Uh, any... Follow me. No, that's it. Let's, uh, let's move on, then. Oh, hello, Mordor, and your surprise army. What do we bring? Ah, oh, that's the army from that castle. Okay, so if we win this, we can take that back, which would be fantastic, to be honest. Problem is, you don't have the southern lances. They're not going to be good. Not too worried about that. Um, they do have Sauron's Will, which is a very good unit, but... Do have the cavalry. If I use the cavalry right, we can win this. Right, let's jump into it. If we win this, we got a healthy advantage. And let's jump into it. Evil must not be allowed to triumph this day. Okay. Let's get, a, let's get that up the hill. The 
Okay, moment of truth, eh? Over there. Can't really waste the lances right now. Okay, like that, and like that. Did he make any archers? I don't think he did. I no, didn't have any archers to this army. Welcome all this. We can get rid of those really quickly. Especially if they run like that. Come on. Get out of there, get out of there. Don't let them get the charge off. They're going to get... Oh, we're going to lose about six of them. Right, who, which one is their general unit? It is this black orcs right here. Okay. I'm just got the halberds really close to that. So far, it's two for two. Oh, someone somehow they hit one of my units. Oh, did you have a uh, arch unit? I didn't know he had an arch unit. Oh, that's, that changes everything. No, no, get out of there. Get out of there. You... Oh, that's not all bad then. Get them out. Get them out. Ah, I like in the newer, <laughs> newer to war games when you, do, you don't have to double click anymore. Right, slow it down because I'm just being a bit stupid now. Right, Maulers are coming back. Second army. They're quite a way away still, which is good. Halbards. Halbards. Don't want to deal with the Halbards. Halbards bad. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. The epic. Uh, it's the music's playing where um, Gandalf falls, fights the Balrog. Ah, such a cool scene. Like in the, the beginning of episode two. Uh, episode two of um, Return of the King. I was thinking of Star Wars for some reason. Not Star Wars. Cretinous fool. Lord of the Rings, episode two. <laughs> two towers. Someone's wheels on low morale, which is fantastic. Getting really touched with that. I thought we weren't going to do that, but we did. It's good. Black Roots routine, that's fantastic. Orc Banner routine, okay, little, little, most of the, army, the first army is retreating, which is fantastic. Waiting for the Halbards to just engage the army. Okay, there we are. Come on, come on, be gone. Yes! Right, that's the first time he's done. Oh no, it's not, not quite. The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. Okay, uh, we want to get rid of all these this time. We can't really have any stragglers. Do some crazy... Uh... We have lost quite a few of our cavalry units, which is a bit annoying, but they have done a fantastic job as of yet. 
taking up 55%. But their second army is a lot stronger. They have some fantastic units, including the Loki Nesrim, which is a personal favorite of mine, as I am a big Runa fanboy, much like uh, <laughs> a lot of Lothings fans. I know Izzy is a big fan of the runic units himself. Right, they are in this lovely, annoying little bunch, which is pretty aggravating. Um, I just want to kind of bait the cavalry on their own. The trolls will be the bigger problem, though. They are a very, very interesting, very, very good infantry shredder. So dumb. Oh, that was a really good charge on the. I didn't realize how good troll um, cavalry were against trolls. I I did see thought like oh no trolls, but like let's see what I noticed that I had an episode uh, with this cavalry charge into the trolls, and it's a really really good job. Like they've only taken half the unit with one charge. Don't fear the trolls. Kick the trolls. Okay, that was not a good charge, in all fairness. God, you most of that unit's gone down. There's only five of them left. That's bad. Let's wait for that Loki Nest Rim to get out of the way. There's only uh, four trolls left, though, which is good. They're kind of uh, a bit confused on what to do right now, which is fine. Maybe let's get my these five units, these five guys back here. Not to be confused with the American uh, restaurant train. Right, can you take out the Lancers? They're the units I'm worrying about the most, if I'm honest. They're not quite in range. Oh, yes they are. Look at that one guy. One brave soul. <laughs> shooting at the... Uh... Right, you guys will not shoot yet. Okay, the trolls are down to... Oh, no, 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 get out of that. No, 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 no. Leave, 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 leave. Please run. Please run. You're going to... You're going to ruin my entire operation. Uh, what are they doing? They're just having a, they're just having a jog. They, it's, <laughs> but they want to die. Jesus. Come on, get out of there. Right, but they want the cavalry uh, onto the spears, which is fantastic. Go for the little, the little cycle charge. That's a really good shot, actually. Right, get the maulers. Get the low gap rim. Right, you guys can keep shooting at them if you can. That'd be amazing. The trolls are still going, which is a bit of a nuisance. Right, come on. Okay. Trolls are just... Uh... That's annoying, isn't it? The cavalry just non-existent. At least the trolls are going down. That's always good. The counter charging us, which is a real nightmare. Right. Don't want them to do that. Oh, no, 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 no. Get out of that. You get out of that. Chase them. Come around. Wrap around. One to nine. Rear charge. Come on. That was a really good charge, actually. That's almost half the unit gone in one, one charge. Right, let's get my general unit 
Probably in the rear charge, to be honest. Fifty-six. The fleet seems almost. Right, that's the low gap rim gone. That's the, the unit I was kind of one of the only units I was worried about. Uh, get my general to go into the back of these guys. For the moment, the fortune of battle goes our way. The enemy general's fleet, so only half our force remains. Come on. Yes! Woo! Right, we're gonna clear this. We gotta wipe them. We gotta wipe the floor with them. Good win for our little general here. The, the captain will survive, but their army will be gone. Ah! Well, you lose some, you win some. That's it. This campaign has been up and down a lot of times. A lot of the times. A lot of downs in this one. But we have smashed it. Another fantastic little battle here. Uh, what's going? Oh, there's just one guy there. That's fine. The enemy oh. are utterly vanquished. This is a great victory, worthy of only the mightiest of generals. And he has healed a lot of the cavalry. Which is absolutely. That's only you don't really care about healing, to be honest. Oh, they did sustain a lot. They are. They're pretty good at like shock. They're shock infantry, and they're not really front line. But another fantastic... Look at that. 426 for one of the cavalry unit. 426. Everyone did really well for themselves. Uh, except for the infantry. The infantry is just kind of there to stop their, my archers being killed off. But a fantastic win for us. And we have managed to take back one settlement. And we probably push on straight away to recapture the castle we just lost. So let's go and do that. And get rid of that. Ah, I retaken. Okay, camp cow sacked. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'll do that. Uh, let's hope that my allies here... Oh, maybe I can bait them into it. Oops. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, uh, what have I done? Why did I do that? Ah, uh, that was so stupid. Right, if we, get hit, we can get retrain him. It's good. That would be good to get Celeborn retrained. Maybe we do a bit more damage then. A uh, low Garth is building. Maybe we'll stop building a low Garth because I think we are going to sell them, sell that this to um, Darwinian. Yeah, you want to get blacksmith in, definitely. Uh, right, that's built that. My king. Elven Come, my brother. Ah, uh, what is this? What is this? Stop it! This is ridiculous. Ah, Isengard is like sorry, Isengard. More than just an like, absolute mental spree. So many units, so many armies everywhere they go. Elves, we must give up the road. So put it down to low. We're not gonna be able to hold it, are we? They're just gonna hit us straight away, aren't they? Yeah. Ah, what a what a nightmare. We thought we we're on the upper foot, and it's just like ah, look at hey. <laughs> Look at this really annoying spam army! Yay! Look at the units they get. Oh, Varag lances. What a shame! What a shame this is. Come, my brother. Assail them. Right, let's, uh, let's head this army over here. Oh, and then you got Isengard with this ridiculous army too. Oh. It's, so, it's just so tempting. It's just so tempting to give this up. I might. I'm considering it at this point. It's just so ridiculous. We, we keep playing it. We keep playing. We keep playing. The show must go on. For now. Uh, let's in, end another turn then and see what happens in the next turn. Oh, where's that come from? They go straight for Dolgodor. Are you serious? Elven warriors, onward, elves. Scatter them. Put them down. 
Okay, my homie's there, ready to go. Uh. Elves, assail them, my lord, my lord. Okay. Oh, I'm just looking at it. I, I... It's just so tempting to just auto resolve, like auto resolve some of these battles, because this is ridiculous now. Like, look at that. Like, they're at war, aren't they? They are. How? And there's, there's zero pressure on e any settlements. They've got, like, no garrison here. And they're just like, ah, oh, yeah, let's go for the player. Oh, it just so it does make it a bit boring to play this when it's just literally Mordor can just take everything, pretty much uncontested. Oh, it's like if you don't beat Mordor in the first like ten turns, you're just not going to win the game at all. Ah, oh, so annoying. Ah, oh, do you know what? Yeah, do you know what? I'm bringing this to an end. I'm bringing this to an end. I'm just this campaign. Just annoy me. I might bring it back up later, but I'm just not enjoying it right now. Um, I think my energy can be put into something I actually really enjoy doing, and right now I'm just not enjoying it. Uh, it's just like it's just gonna get worse. It's just constant stacks of mold or trash, and I just haven't got the economy to do it. I can't even build any units anywhere. Like the I can't even build any units. Yeah, do you know what? I'm sorry, guys. This is one that's just like I, I just really haven't got the energy for it anymore. So I am just going to end this episode here and meet probably this campaign here. Just let me know in the comment section if you want to see more, but I'm not really enjoying it. I just, oh, I'm just sick of it, to be honest. So if you have enjoyed the series, which I am not surprised if you haven't, it's been a complete shit show, to be honest. Uh, please consider leave like, leaving a like and a comment. And as always, I shall see you all in the next one.